REACH is a great group of free services that um, the university offers all undergraduate students. Man, I wish I knew about REACH before this test. But there's still time. Tutoring, but I'm not, I mean, I, what would people think? What are you doing here? What are you doing here? I got a C on my last uh, Spanish test. So. Uh, you got a NIF, amigo. Maybe we can both get A's next time. The house had flooded. It would flood again five times before my mother would leave. My father would fail to hold the contractor to his word. Seven years later, my father still resides at this address. In India, every house has a defined sacred space used for the morning's offering to God. All right, well, the sand mandala was created by the Tibetan monks in order to show impermanence. So they create a beautiful picture that depicted maybe you know, the hells and the heavens and Buddhism and stuff like that, and then they would destroy it. In my crude American way, I too keep a sacred space in my home. I make and I produce and I practice every day as if I am building something through all my hard work. Something I could keep. But each task I mark off of my endless to-do list, each relationship I cultivate, invest myself in, each person I love, each thing I make, as intensely as I feel them in my fingers, can only last as long as one note struck on a piano as it decays and dissipates. How can I keep them?